Hello. Today, we have a common yet concerning question from one of our viewers. They ask, why is my cat going bald on her belly? It's a valid concern, so let's dive into this topic and shed some light on the possible causes. Cats are known for their luxurious fur coats, so it can be quite alarming to see patches of baldness, especially on their bellies. There are a few potential reasons for this, so let's explore them one by one. Cats are meticulous groomers, and excessive grooming can lead to hair loss. If your cat is obsessively licking or chewing her belly, it can cause the hair to thin out or fall off. This behavior can be triggered by various factors such as stress, allergies, or skin irritation. Cats can develop allergies to certain foods, environmental factors, or even parasites like fleas. Allergic reactions can manifest as itching, redness, and hair loss, primarily on the belly and other sensitive areas. Identifying and eliminating the allergen is crucial in addressing this issue. Hormonal changes in cats, such as those caused by thyroid disorders or hormonal fluctuations, can lead to hair loss. If your cat's belly is going bald and she shows other symptoms like weight loss, increased thirst, or changes in behavior, it's essential to consult your veterinarian for a thorough examination and appropriate tests. Ringworm is a fungal infection that can affect both cats and humans. It often causes circular patches of hair loss, and the belly is a common location for these lesions to appear. If you notice circular, red, or scaly patches on your cat's belly, it's crucial to seek veterinary attention promptly. External parasites like mites or fleas can irritate your cat's skin, leading to intense itching and hair loss. Fleas, in particular, are notorious for causing allergic reactions in cats, commonly known as flea allergy dermatitis. Regular flea prevention and proper treatment are essential for preventing such issues. It's always recommended to consult with a veterinarian when you notice hair loss in your cat. The veterinarian will perform a thorough examination, take a detailed history, and possibly run some tests to determine the underlying cause. Treatment options will vary depending on the diagnosis. This may involve addressing any underlying medical conditions, providing relief for allergies, or using appropriate flea preventatives. We hope our viewers found this information helpful. Remember, if you have any concerns about your cat's health, it's best to consult a veterinarian for a proper diagnosis and treatment. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, thanks.